Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to Brick Eats in this video. Taco Bell new cheesy chicken crispinata review. Worth the price. Brick Eats. This is the new one that he uploaded today. And I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. Taco Bell has an all-new menu item. It's a cheesy chicken crispinata. Crispinata, what is that? Welcome back to Brick Eats. I'm your host, Brian Bieber. Look at this. Look at this thing. This is, this is, it's like a little, uh, it's like a Taco Bell Hot Pocket. Alright? <laughs> it's just, it uh, kind of looks like an all-set burrito, except it's got the, you know, the pinched edge. But it is deep fried and it looks crispy. Now in this thing is shredded chicken and cheese. Comes with a spicy ranch dipping sauce. Wow. Now, I like their spicy ranch. I like the chicken. So we're gonna find out how this is. Let's let's you wanna break it open? Well, let's see how cheesy it is. Alright, let me see if I can let me see if I can do this without tearing it apart. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh here it is from the back. It's gonna look better from the back. Ooh, the wow. cheesy chicken crisp banana. This thing's not very big for three dollars and fifty cents, but it looks good, smells good. Let's try it. Actually, it's not bad. It's definitely cheesy, and you can taste the chicken, and it is crispy. So they told us the truth on all fronts. Everything they said is true. Ah, oh, like a gas station burrito. Wow. I actually like it. I dip it in the spicy ranch. See how it is. Wow. Okay. It's actually better in the spicy ranch. Hold on, everyone. Let me check on Snoopy. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, everybody. This is actually a fun little treat from Taco Bell. I like it. Wow. With a deep fried puff pastry, so it is really crispy. And this blend inside of it is uh, it's, it's literally just cheese and chicken. This is so simple, it's so easy, and it's good. I like it. If you like Taco Bell's cheese, if you like their chicken, and if you like a deep fried and crunchy, this is actually worth it. This is this is a pretty good bit right here. I like it. I'm happy about it. I don't know about three dollars and fifty cents, but you know. If we take the cost out of it, pretty good menu item. Wow. I give this two thumbs up. I can't get my other thumb up. I give it two thumbs up, though. This is actually pretty good. You did good, Taco Bell. I'm proud of you. Ah, hey, I'm going to finish eating this little, little bitty thing. If you're looking for a big lunch, this ain't going to be it. This is a nice little addition to lunch. How's that? Maybe an appetizer or dessert. I don't know. Or maybe just mid-meal snack. How was that? Huh. Either way, I'm going to finish it. You have a great day. Hey, thanks so much for watching this video. Thanks so much for watching all the way in. Hit that next video if you want to watch the next one. And until next time, keep trying Taco Bell's new menu item. Because sometimes they're really good. And we'll see ya. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up. And I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my channel or to Brick Eats channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know we both post and share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. And on my channel, we are on the road to 9,000 subscribers. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the three playlists that are on my channel and give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please, everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my channel as well. Also, please, everybody, I would really definitely appreciate that, too. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.